video editing can be a time-consuming and skilled job, so what should you do? If you're not familiar with editing or you don't have the software, then we simply say, avoid it. To do this, we suggest you practice your video presentation and then try to simply create your video in one take. Now, that doesn't mean you only get one shot at it. If you start recording, say what you need to say, then stop recording, great. But if you make a mistake or lose your thoughts, just stop and start again from the beginning. That way, you'll have one good take that you can simply post on your preferred web or social media site, upload to YouTube or email to your clients or colleagues. When you're deciding what to include in your video, the best way is to keep them short. Unless you're creating an explainer video, you don't really need a lot of detail. You can always suggest that if your viewer wants more detailed information, they can contact you directly, and that way you can really tailor your information to their needs. Most statistics suggest videos around two to three minutes are more likely to be watched in their entirety. If you need more time, then consider breaking it into several shorter videos. In our next video, we'll share some hints about going live with your videos and what is video etiquette. See you then.